Hi guys, how you doing? All right, me again. Time to talk about the chromatic scale. All right, the chromatic scale, what is it? Have a look at the book. Da, 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 da. That might be backwards. I'm sorry if it is. Um, basically, the chromatic scale is every note from C up to C, including all the black notes. Or it could be from A up to A or D up to D. Any note up to any note or any other note down to any note. It's this every note on the piano, all 12 notes in an octave. Okay, so we're gonna look at how to write it. Now, let's jump across here, all right. Chromatic scale. Chromatic scale. In the treble clef, as you can see, one of the questions you'll get is, please write a chromatic scale in the key of C, for example. So, like I'm writing a normal scale, I'm gonna start with C. Now, I'm gonna go all the way up to a C here. I'm gonna just draw it there for now, you're gonna see why, it's quite long. When you're going up, you wanna use sharps, that's a rule. So C, C sharp, D, D sharp, E. Now there's no E sharp, so go straight to F, F sharp, G. G sharp, A, A sharp, B, and now there's no sharp here either. I haven't really left a lot of space there. And I should have 12 notes if I've done this correctly. So I've got, so one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, 12 great that is the tonic so that's actually note number one it's the same okay now if I was gonna draw this descending what do you think the difference would be the difference would be that obviously I start on my higher C I'm gonna go down um, I'm gonna end on a low C. Instead of using sharps, I use flats. So every note is a flat. So I'm gonna go C, B, B flat, A, A flat, G, G flat, F. There's no F flat, so straight to E. E flat. D, D flat, C. Okay, notice the way I'm drawing the stems just as a side point. When they are below, like just for example, there's an, I'm gonna draw that note there. When they are below a B or lower, you can draw them like that. But when they are higher, you can draw them like that. That makes sense. Okay. Ascending chromatic scales dun, 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 um, using sharps, descending using flats. All right. Let's jump across here. All right, guys, in your books, you've got page 61 across to 62. I want you to have a go at doing that right now, please. First question I basically just did for you. C chromatic scale in the treble clef, ascending and descending. Then it says bass clef. Um, over the next page, where it says G chromatic scale in the treble clef, ascending and descending. So you're gonna draw it on the way up using sharps, on the way down using flats. The only difference if it says G chromatic scale is it starts and ends on a G. All right, have a go at that. Let me know how you go. Okay, bye.